Okay, four kick mutton. Okay, cool. Okay, here you go, boy. Good night, good night. That right there was a trap. You didn't notice I was in the nether, did you? 1,800 seconds. 13 minutes. That's how long I have until my friends join my server. We've decided to start a new hardcore world, and I have 30 minutes before launch. I'm gonna go around and set as many traps like you just saw in their Minecraft world. 10 people set to join the server. By the end of the day, I want to be the only person on the server. Let the countdown begin. As you heard, I have 30 minutes before all my friends join the world for the first time ever. And as you can see, if I go to server, mode i am in hardcore mode you die once on the server you're out but i got a beautiful thing called creative mode <laughs> it's the perks of being someone who owns the server why am i talking waffle okay listen all right the first trap we're gonna do is something you know i love seeing as spawn is right here the first thing that anyone would do is mine a tree okay so i'm gonna make sure that the closest tree of the server has an absolutely humongous explosion underneath it and we're gonna do that by using these things called observers okay so yeah it, it's sends out a redstone signal if it sees something. Wait, I think it's like this, actually. There you go. Okay. So if, it, if I put a redstone signal here, and then I break this part of the tree, there we go. It sends out the tick, 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 boom. We now have 27 minutes. That stupid intro took too long. Put two power drills here, so that now, if we break the tree, they both turn on. Perfect. There we go. And then we're gonna stuff this bad boy with TNT. Here we go. This is it. This is the moment you've all been waiting for. Someone's gonna be on the server for about 20 seconds. <laughs> There we go. Boom. Okay, put this nice here. Uh, and then we just go pow. And then pow, pow, pow. The next time someone breaks this tree, they're done. They're finished. Their hardcore series comes to an end after 20 seconds. <laughs> I have 10 friends I'm invited to this world. That means we have 30 minutes to do 10 traps. Let's go. Trap number one, done. For this next trap, I'm going to build a house. And that house is going to look like someone's already been on the server. I'm going to build it really close to spawn. What's the most basic house you can think of, okay? One that looks like it took me weeks to build. <laughs> I hope my idea for this one is someone's gonna be thinking, yo, what? The server's been open for 10 minutes. How has somebody already got a house? Boom, that's what I strike. And for this trap, we're not gonna use TNT. We're gonna use some beautiful thing called entity cramming. <laughs> if you don't know what entity cramming is, it's basically when you put so many entities in one tiny, tiny space so that when somebody falls on them, they die. Or when they get close to it, they die. They take too much damage and get bluey. Okay, they don't explode, but you know what I mean. <laughs> and of course, just like normal, I've always been built the house one block too long. There we go. Perfect. And so now we can put one door right here. Okay, and bear with me, okay? Because I am absolutely terrible when it comes to redstone. I'm good at blowing people up. I'm good at making mods. I'm good at doing anything that requires, you know, no redstone at all. But for some reason, there's no mods on this server, so you know what I have to do? <laughs> I have to go old-fashioned. Oh, no. So now, if they, if it comes around the back, there we go. We do this, this, this. I'm pretty sure if we turn this on. Now, if we step on here, there we go. Okay, I don't know why you're not working. Hello. Oh, okay, there we go. So now if we step on here and then we do this, boom, it pulls it away. Okay, perfect. So the plan is if somebody walks in here and they walk through the front door, that they get pulled away and they get thrown underneath. Just like that. It's that simple. And I know you're thinking, Donny, how are you going to hide it? <laughs> I don't know if this is going to work. <laughs> But this is my plan right now, okay? I'm not a smart person. Leave me alone. I tried to warn you guys that I had absolutely no idea what I was doing. You didn't believe me, did you? <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm so doo Okay, cover up the doors with glass. Here we go. Pow, pow. And then pow, pow. Then we stick some glass on these windows here like this. Perfect. And then perfect. Okay. Then we'll have absolutely no windows on the back wall. Okay, perfect. So they, don't can't, they can't see anything inside this house. And then we'll just cover the whole top in stairs because we're nice and normal people, right? No skyline because we absolutely hate sunlight. Perfect. And then boom. Nice and easy. So if we get a door now and we do this, then we go so that the door is just outside the house. And by the way, this is the worst house I've ever seen in existence. It looks like I threw up <laughs> on the keyboard and this popped out. But let's imagine someone comes along and they go blah, blah, blah. Ooh, whose house is this? And then I forgot the pressure plate, guys. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Let's try that again. La, 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 la. Yo. Oh, my. Whose house is this? Someone's already built on this server? Boom. They fall through. Die. Death. Put of blood everywhere. <laughs> Okay, I need to relax, man. And just for safe measures, I'll put a barrier right here just in case they walk too fast over it. Now, here comes the fun part, the entity cramming. If we put a rail here like this and then we get a minecart and we just put uh, however many minecarts you want. Okay, I think it's like 27 is the limit. After 27, I think they kill anyone and everything. <laughs> and then you stand here. If you do, if you are dumb enough to somehow fall in here, you see, the entity cramming will 100% kill you and it kills you very fast. Oh, God. Okay, now time to fix this up. Let's put some chests 
person here so that they know what they're missing. If somebody sees this, they want to come inside, you know? Look, whoa, the chests are covering the windows. This is crazy. And then you put a little bed in here. Perfect. We don't have long. Oh, God. So now if you look on the outside, guys, don't ask me why there's carpet on the outside. There was issues with the redstone, okay? I don't make the rules here. My friends aren't intelligent. It's okay. It will do. <laughs> if I if I find this annoying uh, before I finish and I still have time, I'll come back to this trap. But uh, you know what? This this will do for now. So if they come in, they come in. They see. Whoa! Oh, whose house is this? Uh Oh, boom, 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 boom. They're stuck for good, okay? That's then they get too many chopped. <laughs> Okay, there we go. That worked. And now officially trap two out of ten done. Okay, good. Here we go. Next trap. For this next trap, we're going to need an abandoned portal. Because trust me, this one is juicy. It's one 334 blocks away. That's good enough for me, baby. Where is it? What? We need a surfaced one. This is going to be underground. This is so stupid. Who makes these underground? I bet you there's a gold helmet in here. Oh, oh, okay, never mind. Oh my god, I was looking for the tree. I forgot it was in there. Oh my god, okay. Now that we've got our abandoned portal, if we run over here drop drop slash slash paste there we go paste it anywhere near the surface and now it's time to get rid of all this stupid <laughs> uh the, the, you know there we go okay that kind of looks normal and you know what we're gonna do we're gonna go ahead and complete it for someone perfect then we're gonna get a nice foot of steel and drop it right here like this and then here is where the juicy flag comes in if you go inside of a nether portal it makes another nether portal on the other side like this perfect and then you're gonna want to place tnt everywhere inside of the nether portal okay trust me it's gonna work just trust me, guys. Okay, there we go. Perfect. Then the plan is you light the fruit and steel and then run inside the nether portal. And then hopefully hey, the TNT won't go off until someone next comes through the nether portal. Here we go. Okay, wish me luck. There we go. Okay, perfect. There we go. Okay. So now that that chunk is not rendered in, the next person to go through that nether portal is going to feel uh, the biggest explosion ever. <laughs> Trap number three of ten done. Perfect. We're making record time. We got this, please. Why am I sitting around like I have time for this? Slash locate structure desert pyramid. This is the next one we need. Whoa. Okay. There's one close by. Uh, what does it look like? Okay. Perfect. It's nice and on the surface. People can easily see it. And then here is where the juicy stuff comes in. We're gonna close off the top first of all. Then we're gonna get dripstone. A nice pointed dripstone and spam the ceiling with it. There we go. I don't know why there's water dripping from it. It's, uh, it's not even raining. So the plan is if somebody walks in here, there we go. They go boom, boom, boom. Then they're gonna mine straight down, right? But <laughs> yes, one of these chests is not gonna be like the other. One of them is gonna be a trap chest. There's diamonds in this one. Whoa, a smithing template. I've never seen that before. And then, uh, Okay, all uh, another bunch of garbage. Trapped chest. Here we go. Trap chest. There we go. Perfect. We're going to do a nice redstone current to the top. And let's make sure we don't touch that thing down there. And then we can just keep swapping it out. Nice and easy. The redstone. Perfect. This is the easiest way to make redstone go up. Just keep using redstone. Look at that. Easy peasy. So that now, if we turn this on, it's always on. Perfect. Okay. And then here's where we're going to make pistons. Pull out all of these blocks here. We're going to have to be quick for this one. No time to explain. Why am I waffling like you guys don't understand? exactly what's happening. I just need to do this. Oh my god, they're one step, one block, two forward. There we go. There we go. Perfect. Boom. Perfect. Okay, perfect. Hopefully they don't, they don't see this side of it. <laughs> Then we're going to get repeaters. We're going to put one here, here. Oh, wait. Actually, we'll go up one. There we go. Perfect. So that now, if they step over that pressure plate, turns all of these off, pulls away all of these. Okay. Actually, we have to put it up a bit. Okay. Actually, you know what? Let's move all of these down one. There we go. And then which moves all of these. And then all of them fall. Perfect. Just like that. Oh, my God. This one's going to be good. So the idea is that the person is down there. Blah, blah, blah. Open the chest. Sets off all the redstone. On signals at the top. Pulls all the figures down. And then all of them fall. Okay. And let's test if it works. So blah, blah, blah. Yo, this place is crazy. Opening all the chests. Opening all the chests. Open it all. Boom! Every single one of them fall on your head. Just like that. Now time to fix it. Oh, God. Oh, this is going to be annoying. And hopefully the person who comes across it doesn't take into fact the consideration that this whole middle part is missing. And they just mine straight down because that would be so oh good. Oh, God. This one is really relying on my friends to be stupid, okay? <laughs> oh, no. How is this going to work? This trap done. Okay, I don't care. I'm counting it. Let's go, baby. This next trap, I'm going to use one of Minecraft's most underappreciated mobs, okay? Something that you've never heard of in forever. I'm I'm gonna use a 
Puffer fish. Yes, these little cute guys. That if you get too close to it, survival. Whoa, okay, you need to chill out, boy. Can you can you go away, please? Can you like okay, okay, bye. Oh guys, he ran away. He didn't die. He ran over there, guys. He's okay, he's fine. <laughs> he died. And then there we go. Boom, boom, boom. Perfect. Then we get a nice door. Perfect. There we go. Boom, boom, boom. But a bing bang pow. And then what we're gonna do is we're gonna put an iron door here. So that if somebody walks inside here, they can't no, they can no longer get out. So if they say, What is this? Whose house is this? And then they look up and then boom, it's too late. They're trapped in here with a thousand puffer fish. I'm gonna do this by dropping a nice dispenser here. Perfect. And then we're just gonna fill the dispenser up with the puffer fish. There we go. So that the puffer fish set off the puffer fish. They set off the, you know, you, you guys get what I'm trying to do. I don't know if this is gonna work. We're about to find out. Okay, this one looks kind of chaotic. Imagine if somebody walks in here, they're gonna panic as soon as they see what is on the floor right there. Maybe if I lift the whole house up one like this. And then I get uh, stairs to make it look like, you know, just so it doesn't look like it's the biggest trap of all time. There we go. Then if we get an iron door, we put it here. That, they'll kind of like, they'll think, okay, that's not one, right? Then there we go. If they do this, like that, this might be a little bit better. Oh no, I don't know. This is just as bad. You know what? I got an idea, okay? I'm going to put sign, a sign here that says do not enter. Okay, oh, not enter. There we go. Do not enter. There we go. Now, if somebody sees this, how are they supposed to get angry that they died? But I'm hoping they see these new signs and they think, whoa, that's cool. Do not enter and they're like you know what i'm gonna go in anyway and they go in and they sort of look up and stuff i don't i don't know i'm just hoping someone does this really fast okay guys i was a bit annoyed at how this trap looked so i spent the last five minutes making this i wasted a lot of time but now i have this okay by the time they step in they think oh what's that over there that's a trap chest okay i'm not opening that but they walk inside boom it's too late baby spectate world <laughs> it's just like that okay oh god wait is that enough okay yeah that, that's all those outside blocks okay so it says this block here to redstone, which of course changes all of these. And then boom, 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 perfect. All of the, the dispensers drop. Okay, there we go. You guys understand. Okay, next trap, baby, please. For this next trap, I have built this beautiful thing here. It's just a sign that says, hello, bye, okay? And we have to build this right next to the desert pyramid. And if they open this chest, absolutely nothing happens. But if I put a skulk sensor, something that you've never seen me use before in Minecraft, and put it below here so that it breaks the side. Yes, this took forever. It will make it so that all the sand breaks near them as soon as they step near those sides there and this entire area will collapse there's only one problem with this i can't show you guys how i do it without having to reset everything so you're getting absolutely no preview with this one <laughs> I'm so sorry. Oh, God. Okay, wait. We need sandstone for this part. There we go. A nice gold sensor. Will anyone see that? Oh, they might see that, actually. I'm gonna have to put it down one. They don't need to see it. It doesn't need to be seen from the top. There we go. So, if we just get a repeat and put it here. There we go. Okay. Okay, relax. Relax. Now, if we... I think if we walk along this area, it will make this thing go, which will pop out that one. Okay, so we can't place anything else in this area. I'm just gonna fly away in crouch. Perfect. Okay, that's enough. Oh, God. That was terrifying. Okay, boom. Okay, trap number six, I think. Is that six or five? I don't know. Six, I think it's six. Six done, okay. For this next trap, we're gonna abuse something that people don't really know about. The new 120 villages, okay? Absolutely nothing has changed until today because I am gonna empty our room and I'm gonna put a lectern in right here. A lectern on the surface does absolutely nothing, right? Move, go away. If we get a carpet and put one right here, just like this, we can put a nice redstone current underneath. So if we get Get a nice book in quill and we write a story for someone. I'm gonna say, Welcome to the rules of the village. And then I'm gonna say, Hey, 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 hey. It's just so they're like, What is this book? Then they sign, then they're done. Move away. There we go. Perfect. And then we just do, Hello, if you're reading this, welcome. And then if they flick to the next page, we get a nice redstone current. So if we do like a, as you can see, the redstone's flickering at the bottom of your screen. There we go. Perfect. And then we're gonna load this one up with TNT just like we did the tree. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. This village is about to be exploded. Oh, God. Wait, we get a nice powered rails. Here we go. Okay, as you can tell. Perfect. Perfect. As you can tell, I'm starting to run out of ideas. <laughs> <laughs> there we go. Perfect. Will this guy flick through the book? I don't know if he's going to flick through the book. Is he going to do it? I'm, I'm kind of scared. Does this guy power the red... Is he going to power the redstone? I don't know. Okay, if, if this village is still alive when we get back, then I think it's fine. I don't like how he's just... He's standing near it. Oh, God. That's his job and he's a librarian. But is he going to... Please don't explode. Please, please don't explode. Please, please. 
Okay, we're good. Guys, there's four minutes until the server goes live. We can do one more trap, okay? We won't get to the full amount, but we can do one more trap, I promise. For this last trap, I'm going to take inspiration from a YouTuber whose video was so funny on this matter. His name is Lomedy, and he made a video about redesigning old traps. And my favorite old trap of all time is, of course, the door trap where you can just do this, put a pressure plate down, and then, like, anyone steps on that pressure plate, it closes in on them. Okay, it's, it's the wrong way around, but you know what I mean. I think this one should work. So if they go like this, yeah, okay. <laughs> I have no idea what I'm doing. There we go. So if you walk into it, boom, it traps you in just like this. And anytime you try to leave, it will just... Okay, you see, you see, you can't get out because you need to... Okay, it, is, it doesn't work. But he redesigned the trap so that when you fall through, it's now a trap where you can put one TNT underneath of the gravel. Put a TNT block like right here. Put the gravel on top so that they fall through, right? Perfect. But nobody's going to walk in. But if we make only one of them the one that does it, it is somehow the force people into thinking that this is okay. <laughs> So we just do Sasha sit and the side. There we go. And then there we go. Now we have a bunch of them, okay? That if somebody walks up to it, they're going to see, okay, this does absolutely nothing. But if they step on this one, it will send them down into the ground. Far, far. Enough for them to die. Actually, you know what? I don't know if this is enough blocks. It should be, but you know what? Let's just be, be sure, you know? So then there you go. So they now fall all the way down into the ground forever. I doubt this one's going to work, but you know, better safe than sorry. Now it's time to get off the server and hope that our friends fall for all the traps. Boom! And now it's hit the time. The server is now public and I'm getting off. <laughs> Good luck, idiots. After I finished doing my traps and I left the server, the first person to join the world was Skidzy. I feel so terrible for these people, but I, I had to do it to him. Woo! Here we go, baby. We're joining Donnie's new hardcore SMP. And I'm freaking pumped, okay, guys? We're looking at at least 50 episodes on this new server. And if I don't do 50 episodes, I'm gonna do a backflip off of my desk what what is this okay i i didn't know that portals came already made huh i i thought i was like one of the first ones on the server oh yeah okay someone's been here i sniffed him out wait did they loot the chest they didn't even loot the chuck okay all right yeah let's just go ahead and take all that easy Woo! we already got a good start yo what what is that super ugly house? Hello? All right, all right. Someone's already been here, it looks like, but we just got an ax and you guys already know what the first thing that you do in Minecraft. It's to get some wood, baby. Let's go ahead and chop. What the? Uh, what just happened? I'm dead. With Skizzy dead, the next person to join the server was Rage. Oh God, I didn't think Rage would fall for one of these, but it was perfect. Watch this. What is this, dude? Okay, are we already making traps on the server? Right, like I'm out here, you know, I got wooden. I'm, I, you know, I'm flexing an iron pickaxe. You know, we got some iron golem. You know, I got some, I got some stuff now. But seriously, people are like wasting their resources on this. This is like 2012, or you know, th this is like, this is like second grade stuff. This is bush league, right? Oh no, all right, Linux. You know, walking along, coming on down right here. Oh no, what's this is this is there a prize no i'm stuck donnie donnie ah come on what what is this this is like like I, I gotta call my mom mom daddy he stuck me in a trap again he got me he took all my wooden items <laughs> okay bro like come on you don't even need tools right you just break the thing oh oh my god mom i got unstuck oh you got another one over here right <laughs> I hate my, I hate myself. I hate it. I hate it, dude. I hate myself and I hate everybody on this server. I deserved it. I deserved it. I like the old server better. I don't even like this one. I don't even like it. I don't even want to play here. It's fine. It's fine. <laughs> the next person to join the server was Who's Chaos? So you guys have never seen on this channel and oh, I feel so bad about this one. <laughs> Join again. All right, I'm about to join this whole new world right now. Thanks to Donnie. He, he's invited me to his server, so I'm hoping he's got something cool to show me. I mean, that's what he said. Like, I'm kind of excited. Ah, okay. See, honestly, dude, I know what he's got in store for me. It, it, he always makes some pretty cool stuff. So uh, if you guys want to see more of this Minecraft stuff, like every week, just make sure you subscribe, smash like, do, do all the cool stuff. All right, let's check it out. See what he's got in store. Also, it's my like first time playing Minecraft in like a while. And wait, what? Wait, no, why is there so many TNT? I didn't even have a chance to. He planned this. He planned this. 
I should have known. The next person to join the server was our good friend Bionic. <laughs> Mr. Bionic. <laughs> dun, 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 New village to bully. Hello, bald man. You're looking good today. I'm gonna kill you in a second. Let's check these scams. Oh my god, wait a second. Oh, gee, bro. Bro's actually dumb. Oh, wait, I just made a second crafting table. Okay, I'm a bot. Let's grab the hay because I'm about to be rich, baby. We're gonna get all the emeralds. And then I'm gonna craft emerald armor. And then I'm gonna flex on everybody. And then I'm gonna realize that I am a lie. Emerald armor doesn't exist. Why doesn't it exist? Minecraft. All right, boom. Two stacks, bro. All right, I'm just gonna literally like scam this guy real quick. Hey, man. Yes, very good trade. Yes, this is so worth it for you. Thank you for the six emeralds, you idiot. Oh my gosh, wait. Don't tell me this guy has an even better of a trade. It's the same one. It's the same one. You guys are bots. Wait, I low key need wood though. I'm not gonna lie. What do you trade? 24 paper. Wait, impaling two for 22 emeralds in a book. Brother, you're a scam. Die. No, you're dead. Yep. You're like Dylan Dennis, but worse. Oh, wait, what is this? Elector? What type of house is this? Oh, H, page seven. Wait, hey. Oh, no. Hello. If you are reading this, welcome to the rules of the village. Hey, yeah, yeah, hey, yeah, hey, hey, hey. Why are there 21 pages? That's it? Okay, wait, I'm like actually confused. Do I just take the book? It doesn't even, it's not even written by anyone. How come I can't edit it though? Oh, I can sign it. Fart. Sign and close. There you go. Now I yoink the book. What? What was that? Dude, that scared the... Oh my gosh. That scared me so bad. Who would set up such a stupid trap? You got me killed and I can't even play. It's in hardcore mode. Oh my god, bruh. I'm stuck spectating now. The next person to join the server was our good friend Kipley. Oh, I feel so terrible about this. I don't, I, I don't feel terrible at all. Okay, just spawned in. <sighs> You guys smell that? That's a new server, buddy. New server. Smell the grass. Look around. Nothing damaged. I see someone's already opened another portal over there, though. Crazy people. Speed running. Look, a chicken just walking around. My first kill. That's a All right, there we go. <laughs> Okay, this is beautiful. Honestly, I'm so excited for this. You know how long I've been wanting a server reset for? Just to get rid of all the trash that has been put around by other players. That world was so scuffed from Donnie, man. I'm not even kidding. Just giant walls of randomness everywhere. And look, first little pumpkin. I'll take that as well. This is going so good. Oh my gosh. Is that a house over there already? Bro, the server's been open for like... 15 minutes! What do you mean there's a house built? Who's who's done this? Someone like needs to get a life, man. Like go touch some grass. I'm like, I know I'm on the same game as you are. You already got like a full house built? Four walls, a roof even? Out of here, man. Gotta be kidding me. Okay, well, whatever. I should just go look in the house. I don't know, chat. Listen, I'm thinking about streaming the server a lot more, you know? It's just like a fresh new start, you know? A fresh new start inside of someone else's home. Where's the entrance? Is there a door? Oh, beautiful. Hello? What the? Okay. Okay. What? Are you kidding me? There's no way I'm the first death on this stupid server. It has been like 15 minutes, man. You're telling me someone has built a house, gone to the nether, and built a trap at the front of their house within 15 minutes? Why is their door trapped? Yes, I was gonna take over the house and live in it, but why is it trapped? Oh my God, I can't even respawn. Guys. Guys, I'm a spectator. No. This is the worst. What is this? I hate this house. This stupid house right here. I hope this house dies. I know it fell for the puffer fish. Oh, God. But there was one last trap that we had. I let it show in the world a couple days later after being on vacation. And this is what happened. This is a new era of Linux where I survive on my own in my lonesome. Okay. Stay away from everybody. Like uh, those dudes that just live in the woods and they they survive off of like, I don't know, nuts and stuff. Those are those are like the guys I aspire to be. Two more sticks. What is that? There's a chest out here. No, bro. People have been here. It's probably because of that. It's probably because of the temple. Oh! What the? What just happened? Nah. What are the odds? What's the point? It's actually hardcore. What's the point of having people on the server if you're just going to kill them off? Donnie, you might as well just play single player. Why? 